Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to talk about Enneagram 2. Enneagram 2, who are the twos? Remember we talked about Enneagram 1 last week. If you have not seen Enneagram 1, please go to my YouTube channel to check for the Enneagram 1 and introduction as well. Now, who are the Enneagram 2s? The Enneagram 2, we see them as people who are needy. They are in need. Not really need of what to eat or they are in need of attention, affection, love, you know. So, these people, they, have, they, um, they avoid acknowledging the fact that they have needs but they are in need. Do you know why they avoid that? Because they are always busy meeting the needs of others. They love running errands for people. They want people to see them as helpers. They not really see them as helpers. They really help others, but not without anything. They help you because they want to gain your attention. They want to gain your affection. They want you to see and notice them. They want to be important in your life and they feel the only way they could get this is by being helpful to you. That is who they are. It is just their behavior. So to them, the only way they can be noticed, loved or appreciated is by helping, is through the help they render to others. They can go to any extent. They can sacrifice anything just to make you happy so that you will recognize them and appreciate them. The twos need to be needed they just want you to need them they value time based on the need they are able to based on the help they are able to render others especially in relationships in the meeting let's assume there's a meeting here if we have any twos among us in the meeting the person will not ever sit even if the person sits, the person will be noticing others trying to know what they want he or she might even stand up and start sharing water or coffee or something just to be noticed just to serve a purpose so that you will notice the person and in return he or she will gain what he or she wants they are very warm anyway they are very warm they are it is easy to see and admire them because they have positive qualities but these two they talk much about the needs of others not that they don't have need but they avoid talking about their needs they're always like, what can I do for you? What can I do for you? They want to do something for you. And if you don't appreciate them, they break down. They break down. So they don't want to, people to say they will have needs. So they are ready to go to any, anywhere just to help others. In the family, for instance, even those outside the family, they have sympathy. When, even if their brothers or sisters commit big crimes, you see them trying to sympathize with their brothers or sisters, trying to show love, trying to cover what they did, so that their brothers or sisters will appreciate them in return. So they offer these um, services just to be recognized and appreciated. They don't judge people, they don't condemn people. Instead, they make them feel happy and comfortable even with their crimes. Mm, what a behavior. Are you number two? Well, I am not condemning you if you are number two because you have qualities that are also very good. So, how to redeem number two? Check out when I'm through with the whole nine of Enneagrams. Thank you for joining me today, and I hope to come your way again next week Sunday. Ciao.